guys welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Dominique aka Legally Bomb and if you're not new thanks for joining me again as you can tell from the title we are doing a pretty little thing haul now before we get into the haul let me just say that I have bought this stuff a few months ago like some of this stuff I bought in October November December but you know with sites like pretty little thing forever 21 all the fast fashion sites it's probably still up there and if not it's probably something very similar so forgive me if the stuff that i show you is no longer available i'm really sorry but um what else and i i don't really know how to work my camera for real so when I put on things that are like longer, I have a step stool right here. So you'll see me step up so that you can still get the whole view of the item. And for reference, I'm 5'3", 140, 145-ish. I don't know. Something like that. So if you need a reference on what size to get. But I will say, also about my body type, um, this, from, this is like a size 6. And then this and my thighs is like a size eight. You know, so also take that into account if you're trying to base your sizing off of me. Just because it's the first thing I have right here, it's just this hat. Um, yeah. I have a burgundy one I got forever 21 two years ago. So that's why I wanted it. And I like the red color. Um, I'm trying to be more, um, I don't want to say exotic because exotic is not the word. I'm trying to be more daring or this is kind of step outside of the box when it comes to my own personal style. I will buy the same type of things over and over and over and over and over. So the next thing I got is this two-piece set, brand new step tool so you guys can see the whole thing. Still not showing you the whole thing. At the bottom, it has this split that I really, really, really like. If you watch any of our other hauls, you know how I feel about two piece sets. They're like my favorite because it's like you got this outfit, then you can wear the top, and then you can wear the bottom separately. So we got like three outfits. And I also really like the little um cut V detail on here and I have worn this and I'll insert pictures I wore this to church on New Year's and I had um what did I wear with it oh I had some blue Stan Smith Adidas and a blue fur coat on but yeah I can't wait to wear this again it's just so cute and I, it's dark I got makeup on it but um yeah this is just really cute and I like the little white detail cute little throw on piece when you don't feel like really putting effort into it but you look like you gave effort next i have these maxi cardigans i got two i got this one in this cream color excuse that little thing it's from um i had it hanging up and it created a little dent so i don't and i don't like that but this maxi cardigan i saw this um what do you call it like a influencer blogger this girl I follow on Instagram, she had it. She had it like last year, but it was always sold out. And she would always style it like real cute. And so I really wanted it. And finally, it went on sale. And then this one, I do know I got two different sizes. This one is a four because that's all that was available. Like I said, it's never in stock. So I got this in a four. Then I got a gray one I'll show you in a minute. Then I got in size six. But I feel like the white one is a better fit than the gray one. I don't know why, I would think that the, cause I do like my cardigans to be oversized. I thought that the gray one would fit better than this one, but whatever. And it's, y'all I'm just, I am just so sorry that I cannot show y'all the true length, but it goes all the way down to my feet. It goes all the way down to my feet. And like I said, I'm 5'3", so. And also, the, now that I'm putting them on, like, right after each other, the gray one feels thicker, but I swear they're the same thing. Like, you know, when you go select the item, and it lets you, um, like, it shows you what color it's available. Like, they're from the same thing, but. And then this one, even though it's a 6, it comes short. 
Maybe it comes the same length. I don't know, but it seems shorter. But yeah, this is a great one. Just a long sleeve cardigan. You can throw it on with whatever. Dress it up, dress it down. And you can probably really also use this um, uh, cause as a transitional piece. Like, you know, those cooler summer nights. And when you're vacationing near the water, you know, it gets cold by the water at night. So you can also wear these now and also pretty much year round in my opinion. So next I have this corset top. Um, you know corsets are really in right now, but I will say about this one, don't be like me and feel like, you know, you can squeeze into something that's not your size, because I did be in the press patty because I really wanted this shirt and it kept selling out. Um, I got this in a four. I know good and well I don't wear no four in a top like this, but I bought it. And so I had, it really takes a lot for me to put this on. So give me a second and I'm put it on. All right, so I put the shirt on. And I really, really, that's why I was so pressed to get it, even though I knew it was going to be a struggle. Like right now, it's not even zipped up all the way and it's tight. But that's okay. Um, I, I really liked it because of the pattern. Like I said, I'm trying to be a little bit more daring because normally I would get this in like a white or a black I wouldn't really get it in a pattern so yeah and then also I really like the sleeves and yeah this is size four and it's not zipped up because I can't zip it up by myself and it's real tight but also the the wrist part is real like and I have skinny skinny wrists but this part, it was so hard. When I tried it on the first time I got it in the mail, it was so hard to get off. So I'm about to struggle with that when I take this off. But I really like this. And again, I think this is another piece that you can wear in the fall, in the winter, summer, spring. Well, maybe not like summer daytime because you might burn up. But like if you're going out at night in the summertime, put this on with some shorts, some um, distressed jeans. Knowing me, you know, I love a sneaker or something, but you can definitely wear this with sneakers or heels. It's just a real cute plaid top. A little spin on the classic plaid top. I have not worn it yet. I don't really be going out like that. And so I be having clothes, but I don't be having nowhere to wear them to. But yeah, I really like this top. It's real. <laughs> Please get your real size. You might want to go size up. Not a size. I think if I would have got the six, I think I would have been okay. But this four is like, let me see if I can zip it up. I got it pretty far up. And it's tight, but I love it so much. And if you put it the right way, if you were into cleavage, you might create a little cleavage. But eh, I'm not really big on that. So, yeah. I like it. I'm feeling it. What y'all think? Next! I'm trying to take this shirt off. I'm just trying to show y'all how, like, it will not come over my hand. This is how tight. I don't know what pretty little thing was thinking, but I have to take it off like this. And even then, like, I'm really struggling. You got to take it off, like, inside out. So next is this pretty little thing. Um, cheetah print, leopard print, whatever. It's an animal print dress. Now, about this just... I'm sure you've probably seen this on Instagram because I've seen it a lot. But I didn't see it like that when I bought it. But, I mean, it is a cute little piece. And, again, this is something that you can dress up, dress down. You can definitely wear this with a low-top sneaker. Maybe even high-top, but it just kind of depends. Um, obviously, you can wear it with the heel. And the thing I like about a leopard print is it's kind of neutral. Like, you can really get away with any color heel honestly pink red yellow anything like it's in my mind it's just a neutral color so it allows you to try things with it if that makes sense and then like i said dress it up dress it down um if i was dressing it down i would probably wear it with i don't know some jacket i have because i really like jackets um i definitely wear it with the cardigans that i showed you earlier um yeah it's just a cute little midi dress which and it was, cheap, it was cheap i think it's a size six i got this in a size six okay so this is the dress it's really 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 cute like it really serves you body like it serves you body 
And then on me, let's see if I can. Sorry guys. It definitely goes past my knees. Um, just it's a midi dress. It fits. It's a midi dress. And if you're a little bit taller than me, it might be a little bit shorter. But again, I'm five three, and it's definitely hitting the mid calf. And um, it's tight enough to wear because if my boobs are just like sitting there by themselves, they don't come together like this. So it definitely gives you that push because I guess the material maybe, I don't know, but I love this dress. I haven't worn it yet, again. I don't go nowhere. But this is giving me like date night. Like Valentine's Day maybe. But it's real cute, real cute. Date night, you wanna set your man body. Yeah, this is cute. I liked it, but I knew it was cute because I already tried it on. But I'm showing y'all and letting y'all know it's cute. You need that. But it's real tight. It's real snug, but definitely a fave. And I will say, everything that I've been buying from Pretty Little Thing over the past few months has been a hit. Like, none of this stuff is a miss. Like, I love it all. It's all real cute. Okay, so the next thing I got were jeans. And I will say this about, I have a lot of jeans. So I've been definitely trying to get away from ordering jeans. Trying to order more pants. And I do have another haul video that you'll see. I tried to order a different type of bottoms. But for this haul, I did order these jeans and another pair. And I got these in a size 8. Because like I told y'all, the bottom half of me, I would rather my pants be too big in the waist than me not be able to pull them up past my thighs. Which is why I'm very, very, very hesitant to order jeans online because they don't, jeans online don't always have a stretch. Like these have no stretch whatsoever. So I definitely had to order up. Cause if I would've gotten my regular size six, this would've been a no go. So I just got these distressed, um, are they mom jeans? Yeah, they're a mom jeans. Now that I think about it, I don't really like mom jeans, but I like the distress and then I have to keep in mind that the models that be on Fashion Nova and Pretty Little Thing, they like 5'6", six, 5'7". Five, so things be, you know, fitting different on them. And I be looking like, oh, I want my jeans to fit like that. But now I remember I'm 5'3". And my legs not that long, so they don't really be fitting how I want them to. And so for these, because they are that mom jean, they do have that widens at the bottom. But low key... I want to get them taken in, like, to become more skinnier, um, cause it's just not a good fit on me. But I really love how distressed they were. I don't have any distressed jeans like this, so you see they have that space back there, which is fine. It's whatever. I'm on this thing backwards, I'm about to bust my butt. Okay, let me see. Okay. So yeah, these are the distressed mom jeans. So I mean, I guess they're not that bad. The fit at the bottom isn't terrible, but it's not my particular favorite type of fit. Because like, they stop right at my ankle, right? But on the models online, their stops like, let's see like up here like they're more of an ankle fit but it's okay i don't know and then i don't want to cuff them because i like the distress detail at the bottom as well so i don't know what i'm gonna do with these but except the only thing i see is getting them taken in to be a skinnier fit maybe i don't know we'll see but yeah everything else like in the thigh area they fit really nicely where so the next item is this um, what is this? Oh, this is like a, I was really down. I will, I did say that earlier on in the video, I said that, you know, pretty little thing have been coming through for me. And they have. But with this top, I was definitely disappointed because it has this corset detail right here. Supposed to be corset. But the thing about it is this has no structure. It's real stretchy. And you'll see what I why I make note of that when I put it on. And the way it looks on the model, it looked like 
if this was more of an under boob corset, which it still kind of is, but again, it doesn't have, I mean, you can take it apart. I don't know why you can take it apart because it doesn't have the structure of a corset. Like that last corset top I put on, it had structure. It had that boning in it that made it sturdy. And so for this top, it's still really, really, really cute. I still really like it, but I don't know if you guys can see the fact that in the this corset piece right here it's not it does nothing like it creates no type of shape it gives me no, it does not hug me at all it's literally just sitting here like i have a regular t-shirt on but i mean the shirt is like i said the shirt is still cute or whatever but it's not what i was expecting it to be at all i definitely thought that i was getting um um an under boob corset type of look and I'm thinking maybe if I would have got it in a smaller size. So if you like this top, um, and I'll try to find a picture of the model. If you like this top, I would definitely say maybe try to order down. Because even this material is still pretty stretchy. So you can definitely get away with ordering a couple sizes down. Like I got this in a 6, I'm, I'm sure. And I probably could have wore two, Just because of how it fits. And maybe it would have given me more of that um, under boob corset structure that I actually wanted in the top but it's still a really 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 cute top um yeah it's still cute I really like it um yeah I'll still wear it but it's just not what I was expecting that's all so I told y'all like I keep saying I've been trying to step out of my comfort zone when it comes to the things that I wear and this dress is definitely out of my comfort zone not because of the pattern or anything because I love the pattern of it and then it has this button detail right here at the neck and it's really cute on but the only thing that normally I wouldn't have purchased this is because of the length it's a short dress I don't wear short dresses actually honestly I don't wear dresses um, especially not like tight short ones I would you might catch me in a maxi maybe a midi dress but Especially not, I would have like max midi dresses that are like real casual, like you know those little tank top midi dresses from Forever 21, like that type of dress I wear. But I'm trying to think. Other than that, I don't do dresses too often, just because I don't feel like they really fit with my body type. And yeah, I just don't do dresses or skirts too often. It's just not my thing. But I'm trying to step outside the box and do other things. I'm definitely a pants, jeans type of girl. I'm definitely a jeans girl. And this is the top of it. It's giving me very much Little House on the Prairie with that net. You know? Is that? You know that, that era? What do you call that era? I don't know, but you, you know what I'm saying. And I guess this is the puff slip. Is this puffed? I don't know if you're picking it up on camera. It's giving me um a little bit of robotics because it's so structured but i guess it's not that short you see one day i'm gonna figure out how to record this stuff so that i don't gotta keep coming back and forth i don't gotta keep adjusting my camera i'm gonna learn how to just give you full body off the rip but i don't know how to do that yet i don't know if it requires another lens what if you know drop it down in the comments but until then we're just gonna do what we do you know make it do what we do with what we got okay okay so it's still not showing i still can't it's not showing you the length that i want y'all to see i'm really about to bust my behind okay okay all right now with this dress, I feel like I'm not gonna go get taken in a little bit because this and this is why I do not be liking dresses because of my body type. You know, this right here, I don't have big boobs, and it's I feel like it's requiring me to have some more um something else right here. It wants my body to be structured differently than what it is. And then also when I wear a straight, you know, some skirts are they come out a little bit and then other skirts are straight. My thighs like room. My thighs like shape. My thighs can't do straight because my thighs don't go straight up and down. But it's okay. And then, just a 
side. I'm trying to give you the back, but I'm standing on the baby steps too. It was rising up in the back a little bit. Okay. It's cute, but I do think it might need some alterations just because of my body type, but I guess it's cute. I don't know. I liked it when I first tried it on. But right now, I'm not really feeling it. It's definitely giving me Little House on the Prairie. And it's giving me, like, you know, like, Janet Jackson video structure type. You know, anyways. It's cool, though. All right. So, this top, I don't know where I'm wearing it to, but I love it so much. So, it's, um, what, what did it describe it as? Navy textured glitter asymmetrical sleeve. And I got it in the size 6. It's a bodysuit. You know, the girls love a bodysuit. Um, it's long sleeve. This side doesn't have a sleeve, but it does come around the neck with this little strap. But it's glitter. And you see how it's from a like from a distance, it's giving you like the glitter is the actual material has glitter infusing into it, but it doesn't it has and you still really can't tell on camera. But it's just little small dots of glitter all over the fabric. Which is still cool. Just don't get too close. It's up close, I ain't gonna lie. Up close, it gives me cheap, just a little bit, just by the tech, like the the way the glitter is on here, just I'm just a little bit, but it's not enough to make me not wear it, cause this is really really cute. So this is just, it's a bodysuit. Y'all don't really need to see the bottom. Um, this is the bodysuit, asymmetrical, really 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 cute. Again, you can I mean you could dress this down with just like jeans and sneakers. You know I'm always go to sneakers, but. And then definitely, obviously, you can dress it up with your, with your heels or whatever. Definitely with some jeans, some black pants, and maybe if you even found a cute navy pair of pants. I don't know. What other color can you wear with blue like this? Like, what kind of, what other color pant could you wear with this? Maybe gray? I don't know. I only say I don't know because of the glitter. So, it definitely makes you want to do everything else real chill. Um, yeah, it's really 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 cute and pretty little thing they had a lot of these type glitter items on their website and they all were pretty cute all right so the last two things i got in this haul are two pair of shoes so the first pair are these black crocodile skin booties <clears throat> with a block heel and sorry i had to run to the car and get these now i'm out of breath um this heel is way higher than what i expected it to be um, I thought I was just getting like a booty like with a heel that's like down here, but these are like a for real heel. But I got these because I don't have a, I do have black booties, but I feel like they're like childish a little bit. So I wanted to give you a little bit more sophisticated black booty, you know what I'm saying? And I don't really like the height of them. I wish they were just like a little bit shorter, like maybe like that. Because this comes like real far up my leg and I don't really like that. But it's okay. Not real far up my leg, but it's not like Oh. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like I wish it was shorter. But it's still cute. Now I will say, I don't know if it's because I had to like break them in, but the first time I put them on, they were not the most comfortable. And I've never ordered have I ever, no, I've never ordered a shoe like this for pretty, I've never ordered pretty little thing shoes. I ordered one pair of shoes from there before and they were like some combat boots. And yeah, these, I also don't like wearing heels, so that could also be it, but they were not the most comfortable and I haven't worn them a second time, so maybe the second time around, they'll be a little bit more comfortable. I don't know, but I mean, I like them. Like I definitely still wear them. Like I said, that I really wanted a black booty and they'll definitely, They'll definitely do they'll definitely work for what i wanted them for but they're just things that i wish i could tweak about them but no baby so if my money and i got these in a size uk it's just a uk six you know you have to you have to size down but it's got a regular eight and normally i wear an eight and a half and they fit me fine or maybe that's why they was kind of tight but i feel like if i would got the nine it would have been too big i don't know they fit they fit okay so if you wear like an eight and a half and you're in between sizes like me, just get the eight. I think you'll be okay. Last pair of shoes that I got, which I absolutely love, and they came in a shoe bag. 
there are some thigh high snakeskin boots. So they're actually, on me, they're very, very tall. And I'll put them on, but I kept, just, I kept seeing snakeskin boots on my timeline. Like, on my explore page, on my timeline. Like, everybody has some. I was like, I really want some. But I didn't want the ones that had, I don't like a uh, stiletto type of heel. Like, the skinny heel. I don't like wearing that. I, I can't get jiggy with that. And I know Steve, I think Steve Madden had them. A lot of places had the skinny heels, but I definitely wanted a chunky heel just because... If I wanted to dress up or down, like even if it was chill, I still wanted to be able to kind of chill. I wasn't trying to give a lot with these because this print is enough. You know, snake skin, skin is already enough. But whatever you like, you like. But me, I don't like um, stiletto heels like that. And these, these I also got in a size eight, just like the black ones. And these I love too. And just like the black ones, they was real tight. Real tight real snug on the foot when I first wore thick thighs save lives nah but I really like these but the, and also when I tried them on I mean when I wore them they would not stay up they kind of um slouch a little bit and I don't know if that's because ooh, I don't know if that's because like if my thigh was skinnier, then it would be able to come up. Like, if my thigh did You see how it gets tight right there on the thigh? Maybe if it didn't do that, they would sit up more. Because down in the ankle area, it's pretty loose. But, yeah, they're really, really high. Right. But they're really cute. And I think I got these during their Black Friday sale, so they were like 60% off, so they weren't really a lot. But yeah, these are so cute. The only thing I wish, which is probably on me, I wish that they would come up actually as high as they could. But I think that just comes from me having thick thighs. But no, these are really, really cute. And I feel like you can keep these forever. Alright, that's it for this haul. I'll see y'all in the next one.